Hello everyone, it is me, Simsmaster1, and I am here today with a new LP that I'm going to be doing because, as normal, I am canceling an LP because computer, um, uh, computer problems. And I really hope this doesn't happen to this one, and, uh, so yeah, guys, let's Hi, get to the I'm game. Nancy Drew. This is my center of operations, my desk. Go ahead and poke around. If you want to know the particulars of how I do what I do, take a look at the book titled How to Be a Detective. It's real helpful, especially if you're new to the mystery solving business. And be sure to check out my scrapbook. I put memorabilia from all my past cases in there. A lot of them were pretty dangerous and at times really scary. But don't say anything about that to my dad, okay? He worries about me enough as it is. And whatever you do, read what's in the file called Case File. That'll tell you all about the mystery I'm about to try to solve. If you think you're ready to dive into that mystery, just click on the plane ticket and you'll be on your way. Okay, so yes, as you can see, we are playing um, Nancy Drew Secrets Can Kill. Excuse me, giant human. Um, yeah, so, okay. Um, so as you can see, we're playing Nancy Drew Secrets Can Kill. And, uh, just a quick disclaimer, you're gonna have these weird boxes, maybe, around the game. But, there's, it's weird, it's an old game, and it's hard to, um, oh shoot, I didn't start time. It's hard to, um, get it to fit the screen on an old computer, or on a newer computer. So, uh, yes. And, you know, there's all this stuff you can do, like, you can go in here and look at her scrapbook. Um, you can look at her to, how to be detective things, looking at her case files. Uh, okay, yeah, that's how you do it. Yeah, see, the current assignment is, let's read it, I guess, I don't know, I'm sorry, this is weird. Um, okay, a student named Jake Rogers was killed at a local high school last week. An undercover detective by the name of Beach has asked Aunt Eloise if I could go undercover to investigate the murder. I am posing as a new student to see um, what other students may know about Jake and his untimely end. So, yes, that is the case file, and, uh, you know, you can load your game and stuff like that, but, um, yeah, guys, I have played into this game a little bit, so I kind of know what to do, but there's most of this game I have no idea what to do, and I haven't played it in, like, two years, so, yeah, it's kind of new for me again. Alright, guys, so let's get into the game, and, uh, yeah. Oh, and we get to choose, so we're gonna be a junior detective. Dear Dad. Who would have dreamed taking a vacation to visit Aunt Eloise in Florida would result in another case? Seems a student named Jake Rogers was murdered at the high school last week. And an undercover police detective wants me to pose as a student exactly. to search for any leads at the school. So, it's undercover I go. I'm calling this case, Secrets Can Kill. Love, Nancy. Yes, and if you have music in the background, uh, there's music in the background. So, um, yeah, guys, let's get into the gameplay. Let's go up here and let's look at this. Nancy, I had to go to close, ah, I had to close the school library early today, but if you need to do any research for your case, the key to the library is in the safe. Remember not to enter in the wrong combination. Be careful, Aunt Eloise. Well, oh, okay, and there's a drawer right here. And, oh, these symbols, okay. I cannot read that for the life of me. So, it's like a six pound. Uh, so, now we're gonna go into the case. Let's just look around really quickly because I don't know what to do. Um, I know where the safe is. So, actually, let's enter that in. Okay. Well, we have the. What, uh, is this your inventory? Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, and then this is the case file. What's this? Oh, our objectives. Cool. Oh, no, this is our objectives. Okay. So. Oh, yeah, I remember this. You had to, like, yeah. Okay. So, let's see if I can do this. Without any trouble. I may pass. No. Okay. Cool. I 
think that's how it goes. Okay. Um, well, let's see. No, I need. Um. Okay. I know how it goes now. Yep. <laughs> this is terrible. Okay, um. Let's see. If I don't get into it really quickly, I'm probably just gonna skip until I do. Yeah. That's like bad. <laughs> No. Stay. I want to know if I can do it without being so completely weird about it. I, um, well, there's that. But that's not going to help me any. No. No. Wait, unless... Oh, my God. I... Oh. Okay, um... Oh, okay, no. Ah! Yeah, guys, I'm gonna cut back in once I figured it out. Alright, guys? Alright, guys, I am back finally, and I have figured it out. Hang on. I am just restarting something. Um, alright, so this computer logging name, Eloise Drew, password, all wise elder. Why do I have to feel, why do I feel like I'm gonna have to write that down? Because I'm going to. Um, so, let's write that down. Cool. Hang on guys, I'll be right back. Alright, sorry guys, I am back. Um, so I wrote down the information, which we will definitely go to the library soon. Um, so yeah. Okay. But first, so, I want to search the house a little bit more. So, let's go. Is there anything else in here that I need? It doesn't look like it. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Ooh, in here. Okay. What's in here? Shiny. <gasps> there was a coin. Okay, reminders. Talk to Jake about library books out of order. Call Nancy to get flight number. Call Jackie about Spanish schools. Okay. So, let's go. Oh. What's this? Oh, a key. I am not reading that. There is a key, guys. That was cool. I wonder what all these keys are for. I'm like, I want to know. I want to know. I'm not reading. If you guys want to read that, go ahead. So there. Just pause the video and read it if you would like to. But I'm not reading it, so. Because lazy. I mean, that probably doesn't have anything to do with um, us. Oh. <laughs> okay. Oh. Okay, more coins. That's cool. Me like it. I like it. I like it a lot. Okay. What's in here? There's a TV. I'm assuming we need a tape for that. And I don't like how we can't see ourselves. Um. What? Oh. Okay. I'm not reading that. Again, if you want to read it, go ahead. Pause the video. I'm not reading it. Um, because I don't believe it has anything particular to do with the game. So, is there anything in this painting? I didn't believe so. Okay. Let's walk out, and is there any way I can make... Nope. Okay. So, I guess we're gonna head out. Oh, okay. Pick it up, Nancy Drew? Detective Beach here. How are you? Good, and yourself? Frustrated, Nancy. I need some leads, and you're my man. Uh, well, woman, teen, student, whatever. I'll be at Maxine's diner. Come see me when you've found out anything. 
All contact should be through me. Can do. So what's our cover? Our what? Um, our cover. Who should I say you are if anyone sees us and asks? Oh, right. Uh, I'll be your uncle. Uncle Steve. I gotta go now. If you need anything else, come see me at Maxine's. I'm wearing glasses and a green striped shirt. Okay, so as you heard, he is going to be there. He will probably be there the entire time. So, yeah. How long has it been? That's not... If you have my phone, you're off. I apologize. Okay, I haven't restarted. Hmm. You guys will probably get an extra long video today. So let's go to Maxine's Diner. Um, I don't want to talk to you quite yet. I kind of... Quite Uncle yet. Steve! I don't want to talk to Uncle Steve. Nancy! Why, I haven't seen you since... Uh... Uh, for a long time. <laughs> How's your... Aunt. Aunt Eloise. Oh, she's fine. And Dad says hello. You're staying with your aunt, right? Yes. So, uh, what do you got for me? Well, I was hoping you could debrief me on the investigation. Oh, sure, sure, sure. I'm just a bit... Well, my undercover assignments are usually not so... suburban. I understand. The victim was a senior named Jake Rogers. As usual, none of the family, teachers, or students know about any enemies he may have had. Nothing came up from searching his home, computer, cell phone, or locker. His bank records tell a different story. He had a fairly large savings account and a lot of cash deposits. We suspect he was involved in something shady. Drugs, gambling, or blackmail. That's where you fit in. Talk to the students and see what you can find out. We think he might have kept information about his activities in a notebook or journal. So keep a lookout for anything like that. Anything else? Nope. See you around. Goodbye, Nancy. Okay, well, bye. We're... So he should be there the entire time. So I guess... I don't want to talk to him right yet. Actually, yeah, we're going Welcome to, to Maxine's. I'm Daryl Gray. I don't think I've seen you here before. My name's Nancy Drew. I just moved down here. Then you'll be attending Paseo Del Mar High. I'm your student council president. If there's anything you need, just let me know. Thanks. I might just take you up on that offer. So, what can I do for you? Um, let's do Tommy. Tell, tell me about Paseo Del Mar High. It's a great school. Good teachers, nice students, lots of after school activities. It's just too bad what happened. What happened? One of the students was murdered in the school last week. What happened? Someone beat up this guy, Jake Rogers, and then threw him down a flight of stairs. Oh my God. He worked here, but I didn't really know him. He kept mainly to himself. Who did it? No one knows, and the police are keeping pretty clammed up about it. But my resources say they're calling in some special detective. Maybe even the FBI. Did this Jake guy have any enemies? Sure. Doesn't everyone? Who were they, you idiot? Um. I should get back to work. Um, nice yeah, meeting guys. you. Alright, guys. I am back. Yeah, guys, I apologize. Alright, so we're going to say see, see you, later. you later. Take care. Alright, so now we're going to go... Oh, okay. Bye. Oh. Now we're going to go to the school. And, uh, yeah. Maybe talk to some of the students. Oh, that fucking room. Ugh. Okay. I think... Yep, there she is. Hi, I'm Connie. You're not from around here, are you? Usually, Paseo Del Mar High is really quiet and boring. Lately, it's been totally out of control. Out of control? One of the students was killed last week. Um, who found the body? Who found the body? I heard it was Daryl Gray, Paseo Del Mar's hot student council president. Daryl Gray? Oh yeah, Daryl's one of the coolest guys at school. Who was killed? Oh, just this wannabe stud named Jake Rogers. What do you mean? Oh, Jake Rogers was a total creep. Nobody liked him. I gotta go That's now. So Later. Mean. That's literally me. Um. So if I'm correct on what I remember, I believe there's like a coin in one of these magazines or something. Um. Oh yeah, she can buy stuff. Okay, so. 
up here there is there should be there's like clues that you have to read uh, oh that's just a band me thing cool no oh, Nancy you can't go in there why not but I have a key yeah right you're still not getting in on my watch uh well bitch <laughs> so it's currently December. That's her. A lot of females for the POs. The past so high school students of tomorrow. It's a lot of females. Um, I'm not being stereotypical or anything. Just saying. It's cool. It's cool. Um. Okay. So we're gonna go right, and I think there is an. Asian student in here. I forget what his name is. Yes. Hi, my name's Nancy Drew. What's your name? Hal Tanaka. Mm -hmm. Actually, my first name is much longer than that. But I want to fit in here in America, so I chose Hal as my nickname. I'm a Japanese exchange student. Uh, Why do you think it's easier to have an American name? I want to be part of the culture and succeed in this country. So, what's been going on at school lately? A murder was committed here. Everyone is very stressed out. I heard about that. Some kid named Jake? Oh yeah. Jake Rogers was a dark soul. He created a lot of trouble. Okay then. Um... What kind of trouble? Jake was an Ijimeko. In English you would say a bully. He oh. wasn't very popular. That's I'm behind in my sad. studies, and I must get back to the library. Bye, Nancy. Well, you're not at the library, because that's actually where I'm going right now, I believe. Actually, no, we're going to go this way. Oh. Right here. This is locker. Oh, God, screw that. Yeah, that's his locker. And I think I know that someone's down here. Ugh, yeah. Oh, yep, there he is. Whoa, a new girl at school. Do you realize what destiny has brought you today? Yours truly, Hector Sanchez. But you can just call me the Hulk. Sorry if you hear that. Um. Um. Okay, then. Let me check my time. Okay. Um, sorry. How did you know I was new here? Hey, you're talking to the man, the number one football um. player in the state of Florida. I know all the beautiful girls at Paseo Del Mar High. Are you kidding? Oh, how do you know all the other girls? How do you know all the other girls at school? Isn't it obvious? I'm tall, dark, handsome, not to mention a superstar athlete. Not really. Everybody knows Hulk Sanchez, and the Hulk knows everybody. Did you know the guy who was killed? I knew Jake. But I didn't hang out with him. Sorry, can't talk now. I gotta go to practice. Later. Why do I... How's it going? Um... Oh, okay, so we can talk to him about other things. Um... I gotta go. I gotta go. Bye, Nancy. Because... I want to know that... Um, all the other guys at school... Um... Out of everyone else, I believe... Where did he go? I honestly I was sneaky suspicion as him and I have not played this game to the fullest actually so and I'm not lying to you um so yeah let's go to the library yeah that sounds cool let's go to the library okay so I'm assuming we need our library key no no wrong thing okay right here um, and I actually want to go type into the computer and see what that was all about. Um, one of the things. Well, I, I don't need to log in now, do I? Oh, wait, here I don't, anyways. Um, let's see. Let's go upstairs. Because I forgot what I need. What do I need? What the? What was that? Wow. 
What was that? I don't want to know. So, let's take the key and unlock it and stuff. I'm not quite sure what I'm supposed to be doing, so. I saw what all the other students had to say. Can't check that off yet. Oh, about each other. Okay. So, actually, let's go do that. Let's go see that one jock guy first. Um, yeah, there he is. How's it going? Okay. Do you know how to knock so my mouse. That dude is always studying. He's a huge fan of mine. Real smart guy. But I never understood why a brain like Tanaka would hang out with slime like Jake. How was a friend of Jake's? Let's just say I saw them talking together a lot. Jake's locker was right next to Hal's. But they weren't really friends, is that what you're saying? Jake didn't really have friends, mm -hmm. and Hal, he may seem pretty chill, but I've seen him crack a couple of times. He's seriously uptight. Crack a couple of times? He's always stressed. He's got a temper, a bad one. He lets the pressure build and build until he's wound so tight the slightest thing sets him off. Like last week, I strike him out during gym, and he goes ballistic and charges the mound. He's got some serious issues. Mm -hmm. Now that I think of it, last time I saw them together, Hal seemed pretty upset. What can you tell me about Connie Watson? She hangs out at the gym a lot. I heard she's been having a mm -hmm. real tough time. Um, tough time? Tough time? I heard she's been having some money problems. What can you tell me about Daryl Gray? He seems like a cool guy. His family used to sponsor the annual football awards dinner until last year. You know, he's the one who found Jake's body. Yes. Goodbye. Bye, Nancy. We're just gonna say bye. Um. Okay. Um. I think I'm going to go to the. Talk to her next. Hey, Nancy. Need something? Hulk told me money's been tight for you these days. But what a dork. Hulk Sanchez doesn't know the first thing about my life. He needs to get a life and stop talking about mine. How well do you Who know Daryl Gray? I wish I knew him better. He's the only guy I'd ever consider dating. He's student council president, holds a cool job at a diner called Maxine's, and drives a Seaback X80. Drives a sports car and works at a diner? That doesn't compute. Yeah, I don't get it either. Daryl's family was rich and used to throw major parties all the time, but not anymore. Do you know Hal Tanaka? Not very well. He's an exchange student from Japan and a total workaholic. He told me he's trying to get more scholarships for college. Lately, he's been looking really burnt out. I think the pressure's getting to him. What pressure? What pressure? I guess it's a big deal for his family that he get into a good school on a free ride. Cool. See, you, See later. you later. Adios. Adios. Okay, so really quickly, we're gonna go talk to Hal, and then I think I'm going to end this episode here. Have you heard of Hulk Sanchez? Heard of him? Hulk holds the conference record for quarterback sacks. He's been the state's number one player since he was a freshman. He's also a candidate for a big university, even with his injury. Injury? injury. Hulk got hurt a few weeks ago. Ever since that game, he hasn't played the same. I worry that his chances of playing for a top school are not as good as before his injury. Okay. Do you know Connie Watson? Yes, we've been in a few classes together. I think she was dating Jake Rogers. What can you tell me about Daryl Gray? He's very popular and a good politician too. Just like his father. Like his father? I hear he was a great politician, oh but God. not a very good businessman. I think his company went bankrupt a few years ago. Connie told me you study too hard. Is that true? Connie doesn't know my study habits. I can handle my studies. I'm behind in my studies, and I must get back to the library. Bye, Nancy. Goodbye, Hal. Do you know the combination to Jake Rogers' locker? I'm sorry, Nancy. I can't help you with that. Hulk said your locker's right next to Jake's. Right. Are you sure you don't know the combination? Hmm. I remember one day Jake was mm. mad because he couldn't open his locker. He told me he wished he had a phone handy. 
Will that help? Bye. Okay. See you later, Nancy. How is that gonna help me though? That's what I don't get. Okay, what's up here? Okay, nothing. Alright guys, so that's where I'm going to end this episode here. And uh yeah guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed the first part of Let's Play Nancy Drew Secrets Can Kill. Um so yeah. I will see you guys in the next part. Have a fantabulous day, and I will see you guys next time. Alright, guys. Bye.